This used to be part of someone's car. Now it is ripped off wreckage that is scattered about the left turn island outside one of Sound Transit's light rail stations in Shoreline. Before they did all, all the updates, the, the island was, was much narrower. Greg McCaslin has been monitoring the problem from his home across the street. He says the old curb caused drivers some troubles before, but what construction crews replaced it with before the new light rail station opened is much worse. There was never enough damage to cars where the cars weren't able to move anywhere. Uh, now it's different. McCaslin took this photo after a woman misjudged the left-hand turn, hit the curb, and shredded the underside of her car. A slick of oil from a cracked pan stretched down the street. Neighbors also say the left turn sign for the I-5 on-ramp is confusing because it is placed farther back from the actual intersection, and some people end up in the wrong lane. So they get confused, they turn left, and they realize too late that they cannot get to the station. So quite a few people just like go into the wrong lane and it just continue uh, in the wrong way. Neighbors say there are design issues that need to be addressed. At night, when it's wet, you know, late, there's no other lights or anything from other car lights. Um, when you're driving towards it, uh, you really can't see the curb. And I should just put a reflector on them so people will see them. Joel Marino, Como News.